Hi everyone here, this is Vio from the community of Cofandureno. I uh, wanted to share a little bit of what's been going on. Uh, firstly, I actually um, left LA a day late. I uh, had a little bit of a trouble getting there. We got on the 101, then on the 1 there was traffic on both, an accident on the 1. We had to track back to the 101 and in the end I made it to the airport but too late to, to take my plane. And uh, so I arrived here instead of a Monday, a Tuesday, and uh, arrived in Quito. I went to then Lago Agrio, which is the city nearest to the community. And I spent there one day and uh, taking care of some things that I wanted to check into. I wanted to check about the internet service. Uh, Emergildo Criollo met me and we went there and uh, talked to the agents to see about uh, getting... Um, some service in the community and then also went to frame that beautiful poster that Evita Wapaya, one of the contributors and great friend of mine, um, worked on. So did a few things and uh, stayed the night in Lago Agrio and went into the community the next day where we had our first meeting with the Asociación Suku Women and the president and vice president, Emergildo Criollo, the president and the vice president. Wilson Criollo, together here in the new building that was built for the artisans. And uh, they created it in the most traditional way um, of building. It's actually a replica of their original homes that no longer exist here in the community since they build out of uh, planks of wood now and uh, they also use um, metal roofs and uh, there's nothing really authentic in their building processes here so they are very very proud of this beautifully handmade building with um, trunks and bamboo and uh, leaves for roofs and a soil ground which is actually a cooling um, um, process as well they, they leave the soil and they pack it down and they put the leaves and then they do it all bamboo and it's really um, there's there's space between the bamboo so there's a lot of air to go through a lot of airflow and uh, when you're in here it feels much cooler than being outside it's actually a pretty rainy day today it's rained almost all day and uh, there was a party they did last night with all these dances and uh, presentations and the music went on all the way through the morning so I actually slept during the day because I could not sleep during the night. It was way too loud. Um, the festivities were a lot of fun, uh, but I needed some sleep. So I um, wanted to um, share a little bit of um, what I've done. I'm going to um, compile. I've compiled a, a few uh, videos and photo footage of uh, the building and the event last night and also the first meeting we had with the artisans. So I hope you enjoy this and uh, I will see you uh, very soon on my next uh, report. Okay, thanks. Lots of love. Chava, <laughs> 